United States, uh, the average uh, uh, in neonatal intensive care units, the average uh, incidence is about 7.2 percent. Okay, uh, there are some places that have much more, some places that have much less necrotizing enterocolitis, and it's a disease that we see primarily in premature babies. We'll sometimes see it in term babies, but in term babies it almost seems like it's a totally different disease than we, what we see classically in premature babies. And so just over the last 10 years, we've been able to recognize that there are different categories of what we have been calling necrotizing enterocolitis, and these different categories probably have different causes. So we now have new technologies that are not based on culturing microorganisms, but using DNA sequencing techniques where we can find microorganisms that we never even knew existed. And so we are beginning to study the gastrointestinal tract of these babies using these sequencing technologies. And we hope that we will be able to find something that is specific for this disease.